Okay, so now we're going to factorize an uh, algebraic expression. So a lot of students, when they see this, they're like thinking, okay, my middle term is not a number, or like it has this y, so why do I have x and y? Okay, so don't worry, we'll still do the same thing. We're going to use the multiplication frame. Now, I have not rehearsed this, so I'm not sure whether I'll get the numbers correct at first go, but we'll just try. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I'll just draw my frame first, and I have my x squared here, and I have my 6y squared. So I'm not sure whether, because 6y squared can be 2y times 3y, right? So, okay, I'm going to just try it. So this is definitely x, so I guess it's good. And so 6y can be 2y times 3y, so I'm just going to try. I'm not sure if I can like, get it. So this part will be 2y times x, so it's 2y multiplied by x. So I'm getting 2xy, and this part will be x times 3y, so it will be x times 3y would be 3xy. Okay, it's not looking good. 2xy and 3xy, I'm not getting my 7xy. Okay, try again. So the next round, I'm going to do this x. So I know this part, I'm going to get it correct. So for sure. So 6y squared. The other possible combination is maybe I will do a 6y times y. Okay, so then so that I can get my 6y squared. So let's just try here. 6y times x. So this will be 6y times x, which is 6xy. This would be x times y would be x, y. And given that plus 6x, y plus x, y, yep, I think I've got it. So this would give me 6x, y plus x, y is going to give me 7x, y. Check. Right, so this is the combination that I'm getting. So it's x plus 6y. So this will be my x plus 6y from here. Okay, and my x plus y. So this will be my factorized form for this expression. Now, I mean, I'm lucky to get it on the second try. So just in case, I just want to highlight that. 6y squared can be 2y times 3y. It can be minus 2y times minus 3y. It can also be 6y times y, or it can also be minus 6y times minus y. So if you didn't get it on the second try, don't worry, you have many combinations to try out. All right, so this is factorizing using multiplication frame and not to worry even if you see another letter in your um, expression.